Good morning, friends. I am Jayanti, working as an assistant professor in the Department of Computer Science. In this video, we are going to see about data structure and algorithms. In this uh, data structures, we are going to see about circularly linked list. In before videos, we had seen about linked list uh, and then doubly linked list. This is this is circularly linked list. Circularly linked list means all the nodes are connected in a form of form of and form as a circular, and that should not be a null node here. Okay, that end node, end node or last node will not be here. And this null node will form uh, point the first node of the beginning of that node. This circularly linked list can be formed and uh, formed in singly linked list and doubly linked list. Here, here is the diagram that uh, that represents in the form of a circular. Here, here it consists of a data node and next node. All the nodes are connected here, and that last node, that again next node, will be connected to the head of that first node. Okay, and it forms as a and it forms as a circular here. Okay, this will form a circularly linked list. This. And the last node will points to the first node of that. Okay, this is the concept behind in the circularly linked list. And then circularly linked list are of two types: circularly singly linked list and circular doubly linked list. Okay, we can use the circularly linked list in both the ways: singly and doubly linked list here. And then singly, a eh, circularly singly linked list means. It contains of a circular, so single linked list. On the single linked list, the last node of the next part will be connected to the head of that first node here, the pointer field of that first node in that linked list. Okay, and there should be a no. There should in this circular linked list there should be no beginning or no ending of that list will be here. Like that, circular linked list also can be. A, Formed here. In this doubly linked list, we have two things: preview and uh, last value here. By using that last value of that last node, that can be connected to that preview of the first node here, and it forms as a circular part here. Okay. In this circularly linked list, also we have these uh, two operations: insertion an element and deletion of an element can be possible in these things. Insertion of an element in a circular linked list can be formed in three ways: insertion at the beginning of that list or end of that list, or we can insert an element in between of that nodes. We can insert in these three three ways. Okay, insertion at the beginning of that list to insert a node at the beginning of the list follows the steps: create a node. Here we are going to create a new node here, the, uh, and that represented by the word. By the letter T, make T gives next next equal to last of next node here, and then last last of next node equal to T. Here we are going to connect connect the last with that T T node, and then insertion at the end of that list. To insert a node at the end of that list follows the steps: create a node say T and make T gives next equal to last of next. And then last of next equal to t here, and then last equal to t. This t represents that the node will be connected on that, and then connected on that list. We can insert on insert into that list here. And then next one is a deletion of an element. Deletion of an element also can be possible in three ways: deleting a node at the at a, at a, uh, it in any node in a circular list. And delete the lost node or delete any node from that list. Okay, here the here the concept also same. Free the node's memory. The lost value should be a null. A node always points to to another node here. So null 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 element must be used here. And any node can be can be set at the starting of that point. And nodes are traveled quickly from the first to last here, and the next deleting at the last node. We can locate the node node before the last node here. Which one we want to delete there? That can be set it as a temp, and keep the address of the node to the next of that last node. That is the temp, and delete the last memory here, and put the temp at that end here. 
and then deleting a node from that in anywhere from the circular link list we can delete an element from we can delete the nodes in that circularly linked list in anywhere else here okay and then this circularly linked list data structure can be used to uh, storing a value or list the last node or uh, this can be done by using this circular way and this circularly linked list can be used for continuous loops uh, such or uh, we can use this uh, algorithm in games or compact data structures uh, like a Fibonacci series on these places we can we can use it here for developing of the games it should be very useful here useful of this thank you for watching this video